are back here at home. We do have a little bit more rain, but wow, can we talk about this weekend? That super store soaker storm absolutely delivered. Look at some of these numbers so far, just in really the four months that we have had in 2024, we have seen nearly double our average rainfall. We are well above. Things are looking good in that department. And how about the front yard, the backyard? Is it so green or what? This is our camera around City Park, that gorgeous time last showcasing the blue skies. Certainly a few cumulus clouds racing in off the foothills. But wow, is it just a stunning afternoon across really much of the state? We touched 67 degrees out at DIA, just a hair above that average, and our carbon dioxide levels continuing to rise at 422.11 parts per million. We were in the upper 60s, low 70s out there in northern Colorado, 70s into southeastern Colorado. You hop up across the Rockies, more 50s and 60s. Tonight, a weak storm system is cruising across the northern section of the state. As we zoom in, you'll notice just a little bit of snowfall developing across the spine of the Continental Divide. Some rain showers filling in for lower elevations. None of this really making its way here to the metro area over the course of the next 12 to 24 hours. This system just grazes northern Colorado and really it looks to be throughout the overnight period. We will find a few scattered snow showers, but amounts will be way up high above 10,000 feet. Tonight, partly cloudy with overnight lows dropping off into the 40s for us. Again, near the freezing mark or below up around the Front Range Mountains. For us, we're tracking partly cloudy skies throughout much of the day tomorrow and temperatures also going to return to the 70s for us. It really should be a nice afternoon here in the metro. The one caveat to the forecast we for some pretty strong gusty winds, winds upwards of 20 to 30, maybe even 40 miles per hour. But it's a warm one east of the Rockies, 70s and 80s, 50s around Steamboat and over to Yampa here in the metro area. Maybe a light jacket early on for the kiddos, sending them out the door to the bus stop by the afternoon. They'll be shedding those layers as it should be a warm one. We'll be tracking a few storms coming our way Wednesday afternoon and evening. Cold front slides in that drops us to the low 50s with scattered rain showers Thursday, but the weekend is here and so is the sunshine and highs returning to the 60s and 70s.